What's up, guys? Welcome to the Rob Squad's Home Theater. If you're new here, it's your girl, Amber. And your boy, Jay. So this is actually something we're super excited for because over the last month, I would say, we've watched Halloween movies. Our last re reaction was a heavy reaction. So we were looking for creepy. something light and fun. And you guys suggested that we check this movie out. Uh, we are watching Trading Places, and you guys said it had Eddie Murphy, uh, Dan Aykroyd and in Jamie it. And Jamie Lee Curtis. So people that we've all seen in movies that we've reacted to so far. Jamie Lee Curtis was actually in our most recent in Halloween. One, one of our most recent. And um, growing up, we both loved Eddie Murphy. We know him as Dr. Doolittle. Yes. Uh, so it's funny to us to get to see him before he became Dr. Doolittle because we were like, oh my goodness, Dr. Doolittle cousins. So, uh, and what was that? The Dr. Beverly Hills reaction. Dr. Doolittle, Professor Clump, Norbert, yes. and then oh, gosh. obviously Beverly Hills cop was hilarious. So yeah. we're excited excited to see him and many others in trading places as we always say grab your drink your favorite snack and your blanket let's go ahead and get into trading places let's go Dan Aykroyd. Holy wow. cow. It'd be so cool to go to like a fresh market though. Mm -hmm. Go to walk it and be? see all the stuff. Yeah. James Belushi. <laughs> That's how you make that real orange juice. Look well, at what they're playing the basketball hoop. on. Yeah. It's like a milk crate A milk box. crate and a piece of plywood. We must be getting two different perspectives. Because, like, one's, mm -hmm. like, affluent, kind of, and then the next one, you see, it's, like, a more down, down area. Right. <laughs> What a setup. That man's living that lavish I'm life. I'm saying. Ugh. For your breakfast, sir. I don't care how rich you are, though. I, I would never want a, a servant. Okay, but breakfast in bed, though? I could do that. Because I'm always one who cooks a breakfast. You're always the first one, though. Yeah. To give you breakfast in bed, I have to wake up at like 3 a.m. It's funny. I'm a morning person. I'm an early bird, and Jay likes to stay up late. They even pick out his clothes and help him get dressed. No. Oh okay, my Okay, that's goodness. spoiled. I was like, I'm, I'm not even gonna open it myself. I'll wait for you. Like, if you can't do simple things, open and close the door yourself. Hey, Mr. Mitchell. Good morning. Morning, Mr. Mitchell. Well, he's obviously very well known. Big shot, the big dog. Good morning, Mr. Winthrop. Good morning. I would just, every morning I'd walk in the front door and scream, good <laughs> morning, everybody, as loud as I could. Oh, I would hide and go through the back door. I knew it. Oh, look at that mansion. Good morning, Mr. Duke. Good morning, Mr. Duke. So that one building was called Duke and Duke. Wow. See, I couldn't do that. Because I'm the type of person, when I say excuse me to somebody, oh, and they don't say, it's okay, or no excuse it's me, or they just say something back, it bugs yeah. me. So if I say good morning, you don't say it back, that would bug me. It's topped out. I say we sell now. Another few seconds. The market's closing. We won't get the order in. It's going up. A little bit, didn't it? We just made an extra three hundred and forty-seven thousand dollars. Get me Winthorpe. Well, of course, I never had an instant of doubt in my mind. Morning. Oh yes, I'm sure a lot of people went belly up on. I'll see you at the club. Wow. Just as easy as that. Made three hundred and forty-seven thousand. Mm -hmm. He see, did. He made them that much money. In see, I don't understand sitting. stocks. I don't. I don't I know any know. of that. Merry Christmas. Thank you very much. Daddy. Right hand. Anything. Thanks a lot. How you like 
a stump up your ass. <laughs> Dolph, we're about to make millions of dollars in frozen orange juice, and you're talking to me about human nature. Money isn't everything, Mortimer. Yeah, I say, all he cares about is that money. Mm -hmm. Mother always said, bet you thought I'd forgotten your Christmas bonus. There you are. Five dollars. Maybe I'll go to the movies by myself. <laughs> Half of it is... Got rich and tipped him five dollars for Christmas. Mr. Mortimer. Five bucks. Just made all that money and gave him five bucks. Mm -hmm. We uh, need a fourth for squash today, Lewis. Are you interested? Squash? I don't know what that is. I don't even know what this word is. Todd? <laughs> <laughs> Awful lot of money. Can't get around the old minimum wage, Mortimer. They're only paying minimum wage, and he's complaining about it. Thoroughly, and there doesn't seem to be a Clarence Beeks employed with the firm. <coughs> <coughs> Clarence Beeks? Oh, yes, of course. He's doing something... Top secret for us. Research. Ah. That's a little weird. Never forget, she's our grandniece, Winsor. You better make an honest woman of her. sketchy. Well, I'll certainly try, sir. Act Good. Good work, Winsor. Oh, so he's engaged. Just dismiss him. Mm hmm It's a product of good environment. With environment. <laughs> With his genes, you can put Winthorpe anywhere and he's gonna come out on top. You genes and environment Reading again. Randolph. Me and you! You bitch! <laughs> Golly. Ugh. What's he do? He's playing it up right now. You were in Nam? So were we. Where? Um, I was. He took his sunglasses off. Battalion's, uh, Commando Airborne Tactics Specialist Tactics, uh, Unit Battalion. Unit Battalion. <laughs> Oh my I god. Can, uh, <laughs> I have a name! I have an old Thank you, Lord! Man! I can walk! Jesus! <laughs> Praise Jesus! Uh, I appreciate this! Oh, this is beautiful! I can't believe it. Thank you! I don't know what to do with glory be to God! <laughs> but uh, I can't believe it! Oh, you beautiful! Jesus. This is, I can't thank you! First Moses, now this! God, Jesus! First Moses! <laughs> God, man. How you doing? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that, Stop. man. This is help. Hey. Take it, take it. I'm getting married. What the heck? Come on now. You know ain't nobody hurting you right now. He's in there. After him. What in the heck? Oh, he wasn't trying to hurt you. Excuse me. Watch out! You, you were being scared. Hey, stop him! Stop him! He's inside! That was crazy! Oh, he's about to get in so much trouble. Get him! <laughs> oh. Is there a problem, officers? <laughs> he wasn't trying to take his stuff, you though. No, he wasn't. An assault, attempted robbery, and resisting arrest. Well done. Win I mean, he did run and resist the arrest because this guy was falsely accusing him. I would like to press full charges. People like this are a menace to decent society. You have a history of juvenile arrests, I presume. Drug abuse, reform school. This guy, I want a lawyer. Is there a lawyer in the house? <clears throat> oh. oh. Maybe I, I want to press That man is a product of a poor environment. D There's absolutely nothing wrong with him. I can prove it. He's a need. Really? Probably been stealing since he could crawl. You didn't catch their drift from the beginning. I'll bet that that man could run our company as well as your young Winthorpe. Are we talking about a wager, Randall? Because he's the genes versus environment mm. crap they got going. We'd have to heap a little more misfortune on those narrow shoulders. So you're going to play with Winthorpe, too? How much you want to bet? The usual amount. Why not? This is just a game to them. They're playing with yeah, men's that's lives. Yeah, twist, that's twisted. Like, they want to take everything away from one. In such a situation, you have no time to think. In Dude, this is, this is annoying. A scientific experiment. A scientific experiment. 
Well, not at all, sir. That's what they're calling this is their scientific experiment. And a very good night. What a scumbag. (laughs) It's the day the crop reports come out. Is this is the way he's even the talks. The way he's talking, yes. The Department of Agriculture gets those estimates from all over the country. Or- wow, this is like <laughs> how they're getting in the mood is talking about this. You know something, Witherspoon? We are going to make a great cop. Winthorpe and Witherspoon. Witherspoon. Excuse me, sir. What is it now, Coleman? <laughs> I have everything I want. Good night, sir. He looks worried. He had to make sure the dude had his payroll before I made my move. Tell us how you cut him. So now he's in there trying to play it up like he did. I am a chain belt kung fu. Bruce Lee was my teacher. Watch this. What? 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 That's called the quarter blood technique. Quarter blood. Tell how you beat on the cop. Wasn't no cop, man. It was cops. When they brought you in here and Book was crying like a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> now still walking in here like a man, so get out of my face, all right? I mean, you you beating up on a man, you putting a man in the hospital, how come I don't see no marks on you? Because I'm a karate man, <laughs> all right? Karate man bruised on the inside. <laughs> they don't show their weaknesses. But you don't know that because you're a big Barry White looking motherfucker. He <laughs> said big Barry White. <laughs> No time to be sitting inside this cell with you. What? They got that slick bag. Yeah. Didn't I tell you the phone and my limousine is busted <laughs> and I can't get in contact with my bitches? <laughs> hey, look, sit down, all right? It ain't Jive Turkey. So close to Thanksgiving. It's Jive Turkey must be a bad thing to be. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're doing. I can see that already. Do you know what you're fucking with? <laughs> <laughs> As he's lifting <laughs> eight in the air. <laughs> Know you fucking with in cell number four on the ninth floor. <laughs> Billy Ray Valentine. Yes. Move it. <sighs> Did you hear him go? Oh, he was so bad. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, <laughs> May I suggest using a nice stick off? Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> he don't know how to just be in his own little bubble. Is he wondering how he's out? How yeah, how he made bail. Why should we do that, Mr. Valentine? We're the ones who bailed you out. He's like, what's going on here? I know, because the other dude right. trying to lure him in with whiskey. With whiskey, you, yeah. Like... Did you see the way he's looking at him? I would, too. <laughs> what's my next move, man? Thank you, you've been heavy. Driver don't talk? Mm-hmm. Uh, no. No, I believe I can hang out with you fellas for a little while. Excellent. <laughs> you knew I'm he would, boss though. boss Duke. How you doing, Randy? What's happening? My younger brother, Mortimer. Hey, Morte. 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 Red Valentine. Capricorn. Capricorn. The full song. Yeah. <laughs> He'll look after your day-to-day needs. Can I relieve you of those, sir? So are they kicking homeboy out the house? That's what he said. They said that he needs to lose his house, his... But he, they want him to lose everything. Take care of you. He is your servant. May I take it? Get out of here, man. Valentine very badly wants to take a... I think you'll enjoy it. Okay, but that bathtub looks fantastic. Say, man, when I was growing up, we wanted jacuzzi. We had to fart in the tub. This is bad. <laughs> when you think of... Do you hear him singing? Sounds like me. They're very musical people, aren't they? What shall I do That's with you? Well, they have racial racial biases, and they're mm. using that for their whole right. environment versus I, I get genes. That. But he also has a little mouth on him as well. But it's it's hard to listen to. Everything you see in this room is yours now. Ah, uh-huh, this is my stuff. <laughs> you see him putting in his pockets. The curtains, man. Look at the curtains. It's beautiful the way I got. The- Why are he taking a thousand dollars? Mortimer. <laughs> 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 I just would not want to be the butt of someone's experiment. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So we're about to see Winthorpe mm-hmm. lose his home. That's aggressive. Using Mr. Beaks for this, as well as for the crop report. Oh, that's the they paid 50000 for. Yeah. What is this? Synchronized service. 
some secret society type stuff. I know. Well, where are they? Excuse me. Sorry. What are you putting in his pocket? I don't know, but he slipped something in there. There is something rotten in the Heritage Club. It's the Heritage Club. Those bills were stolen from a coat in the cloakroom. One of our operatives witnessed the theft. Dang, they're gonna pin him with it. So three for three fifties. <sighs> That's set up. Uh, no, no, wait That's a minute. I've never seen this money before in my life. Dang. Randolph Mortimer, this is outrageous. What are you doing? I haven't done anything wrong. I'm glad your parents are not alive to see you this. You are messing with him. That's dirty. Like they're, that's they're like dirty. sitting there thinking that just because they have all this money, they can like play God with people's mm. lives. Strip you little shit before I tell you a new asshole. Mm -hmm. mm. Did, did you hear what this man said to me? Mm. Now, I have witnesses. This man. I have witnesses. Me. Yeah, now you're getting phys physically hands put on you. La Boheme. It's an opera. It's an opera. And cellophane bag. Oh no, I was about to say, how are they gonna lock him up for 150? That's PCP, phenocyclidine, angel dust. Maybe they put angel dust in his pocket. In a three to five mandatory. That's not fair. I mean, I know Winthorpe seems to be a twerp, head, but man. still, you can't do that. Terrence, get the ladies some champagne. In fact, champagne for everybody. Oh, he big balling uh -huh. now. He, about he to came come in out. there to fly. He about to come out flexing. Are those the guys from the jail? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm a sexy man. Woo. I'm very sexy. He said I'm very sexy. Uh, full sexy uh, and not understand my sexuality. I <laughs> You the motherfucker I was gonna call. <laughs> yeah. That's all he says is yeah. yeah. Motherfucker. Moi. Mm -hmm. Right outside. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Uh. Come on, everybody. Uh, he is flexing too mm -hmm. hard. You knew he was gonna live it up, though. The butler's like, hey, I'm mm -hmm. for this. Persia, Persia, Persia. He about to give him all the boot. Yeah. I'm waiting for you, Billy Ray. Oh my gosh. Yeah, he about to kick them all out. Mm-hmm. So this is my nice house. Y'all being disrespectful. I just got this nice crib. Yeah. Get to stepping. Look at the Look butler. At the <laughs> Ain't nobody listening to him. Get the fuck out. <laughs> Up out of here. Get He's to step so in, as Martin moody. says. He cracks me up. Right, just, yeah, right. Just get the fuck out, man. Let's go. <laughs> Shit. He didn't even want to have a conversation. I forgot all about this guy for yeah, a minute. Yeah, for a moment. Let's go, Winthorpe. Oh, he's no. been beaten up. And all this is because of two old rich guys They just wanted to see something. Yeah, an experiment. You're right. Excuse me. I'll see you later, Wop. That's Jamie Lee Curtis. It is. <laughs> she looks so uncomfortable. And stole my clothes. Those men wanted to have sex with me. Just somewhere else. One of them tried to bend me over the stuff. Oh. <laughs> Mother wants me to call off the wedding, and so does Todd. Oh, they're setting him up again. Preparing charges against you for embezzlement. For embezzlement for a hundred and fifty children. I wanted to have and breastfeed be a hero. And breastfeed. <laughs> Come on, baby. Uh, Just a dime bag. Oh, she's making him look like a dealer. I never want to see you again as long as I live! Oh, yeah, they just ruined it for him, for sure. And he's just like, what is going on? I know. Like, everything falling apart one after the other. You have no clue why. Everything's 
was a joke. I mean, I know he was a little bit annoying, but not like <laughs> you can't mess with somebody's life just because of that. You can't mess with somebody's life, period. Please let me in. I'm, I'm having trouble with my key. Who are you? What do you want? <sighs> Coleman. Are you just going to pretend like he doesn't even know him? Coleman. There's no Coleman here. You've made a mistake. Like that. They're really messing with this. All right, guy. come on, Coleman. At least, at least you, man. He acting brand new. No, he new. works for the uh, for Duke and Duke. I guess. Let me. Ugh, that's tough. He's got no money, no clothes. Oh, he lost his fiance. No home. I'm sorry, Mr. Winthorpe, but the IRS has frozen your account. Oh. I've been ordered to repossess them. What? Oh my goodness. Roger. Like, I feel bad for dude. I feel bad. Get off your knees, Louis! Yeah, I was about to say, please get off your knees. <laughs> and a manicure. Never done a hard day's work in your life, have you? <laughs> you can tell by his hands. <laughs> So he went from being top dog, all the money mm -hmm. he had, to now counting on a prostitute. I'm guessing she is. <laughs> right there, the dude right over there. That's my car. <sighs> oh. Oh, that's my car. Literally, we just saw the the switch, mm -hmm. the trade. There's some strange shit going on here, Coleman. Yeah. His advice was just be yourself because no matter what, they mm. can take that away from you. Duke and Duke get the commissions. Well, what? so they're set up nice. Yeah, either way, it doesn't matter. They're getting their money. Sounds to me like you guys are a couple of bookies. Told you he'd understand. <laughs> so he just related it to being a genius. Books. Yeah. Figured out what happened. High profile. It's the same guy who tried to rob. High product bookies. He was wearing my Harvard tie. He went to Harvard. Mm. She's going to have to live with that and listen to that. Don't understand it. There's going to be retribution. Oh, he's going. She's already getting sick of listening to him. I'm to tell you how much I appreciate this. Uh, uh... Ophelia. Oh, Oph Ophelia. Mm hmm. I like it. I'm used to Jamie Lee Curtis with short hair. Mm -hmm. That's the deal. And it's not subject to negotiation. Understood? Mm. She's a businesswoman. She did say she was smart, though. She's doing what she got to do till she can retire, I mm -hmm. guess. Who's all their money, right? They out there panicking right now. I can feel it. They out there. They're panicking. Look at them. I think he's got, like, mm -hmm. a real-world perspective yeah. that they're not used to. I wait till you get to about 64, then I'd buy. You'd have cleared out all the suckers by then. He like me. He cheap. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's how I be thinking. <laughs> You think the other guy tried to trick, tried to test him? I don't know. All right, man. All right. Tested him. You were right. He tried it. Mm -hmm. See. Say the car, my friend. What? To the end. Must be in the. Is this what rich people do? <laughs> like, you know, I mean, we didn't grow up rich. We we're not rich. Like. In Whitley Hall. Are these things rich people like really, really rich people really do? Country club type people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? That's I can see you being part of the quartet. Stop. Ball. <laughs> oh my. Look at him. Ah, there you are. I'm going to be sick. Don't worry. I'll handle this, Pookums. Pookums. Completely awful, but I just wanted to assure you, my friends, that I am completely... Look at his outfit. That I can rely on you, my friends, as character witnesses. Damn, they don't somebody. look like nobody that's going to put their neck out there. I don't think so. Clear to perhaps advance me a small loan until the hearing. Oh, no. I believe I'm still a member of this club. Nobody wants to buy your drugs here, Louie. She was quick away. to flip. Look, he's already got her, his hand on her shoulder, hey, calling her pookums. As, as we say nowadays, she for the streets. <sighs> she is for the streets. She flipped too quick. $6,955 retail. Why would you spend that much on a watch? In Philadelphia, it's worth 50 bucks. 
Just give me the money. Oh, he's really He's bad. selling the 50. And he says, how much is that Cadillac? Oh. S. Put on each door. A big S. Oh, no. <laughs> bad joke. <laughs> <laughs> that was a bad joke. I'm considering going long on April wheat. What do you think, Valentine? Everybody stop to hear. And two. And he's just sitting there still watching. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if that joke was gonna land or not. She moves real close to him. Mm -hmm. too. Brother, you bet not. I have to do something. Stay here. And she's taking care of him. So that, that's, she, that's she does have a good heart from the beginning. Well, <laughs> besides helping set him up. Ten o'clock. Here's Johnny. That's Here's a Johnny. reference from uh, Shining. Shining, which they said is actually from a talk show. So she had to turn on her clients mm -hmm. now, a regular. What is she doing? I'm just protecting my investment. That's all. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go shopping and then I'm going to come back and make you a nice quiet dinner. Oh, she likes him. I know, she's being very nice to him. Oh. Just enjoy your life, man. That that woman he's with seems a lot better and nicer than all these people. Oh, absolutely, but you you would understand him being upset, like all of a sudden just oh, losing yeah. everything. <laughs> Who just cut some steak and put in <laughs> And that is a dirty Santa suit. That was that Beaks guy. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's why the Santa suit's so dirty. They really made him down and out. Uh-uh. <laughs> Ew, in the dirty beard. That's nasty. They're talking about it blatantly in front of him. Right. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, they're finally going to meet. Oh, now he's planting. Come in here quickly. I finally caught him. <sighs> wow. It's like, <laughs> you're going to do what somebody did to you. Put that phone down. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. This... Thorpe would fall to pieces. You took everything away from him. <laughs> so is he turning? Did you see he's putting the joints in his pocket? Mm. <laughs> he said, "I'm definitely gonna keep these though." Mm -hmm. Making sure no one's in there. Mm -hmm. But you know, you smell. He put that whole thing in his mouth. Here. One dollar. All of that to two men's life for one dollar? Deranged would be killer. And you're proud of yourself and laughing. And returning Valentine to the ghetto. I don't want They are truly awful. Do you really believe I would have a nigger run our family? Oh. Of course not. Neither would I. They're so gross. We should have a very happy New Year. I wonder what they're trying to set up now. <laughs> Or These the whole time. Just, they're twisted, man. They're twisted. They're twisted. They play God. They're racist. Winthorpe! Oh, Winthorpe is gone. He's out of there. Yo! Yeah, this is not the right Santa. <laughs> he just pulled it. <laughs> That's gross. Oh. Fish. Ugh. And he's, he's literally biting through his beard, too. <laughs> he's just, oh, gosh. He's peeing his pants. Oh, wow. Oh, no, no dog peed on He's getting peed on. <laughs> yeah. 
cherry on top right there. Only fitting. No. <gasps> no. No. He was really going to kill himself. Louis? Oh, no. <sighs> it was a dream. I dreamt the... Oh, he thinks that... Mm. It was just a bad dream. You wish, buddy. It was all because of this terrible, awful... Uh... <laughs> the dukes, it was... <laughs> Dead, Dead man, Valentine! It was an experiment! This is guinea pigs, man. Literally is guinea pigs. Mm, for real. You can't just go around and shoot people in the kneecaps with a double barrel shotgun. <laughs> you pissed at them. I mean, the poor people. <laughs> He's really got all the shotguns out. Yeah, research and I can get his hands on that top secret crop report two days before it goes public. That's what they've been setting up. Mm -hmm. Eggnog. <laughs> I, I like, like him. Carl, hold on. Fuck off. <laughs> Golly. The section four. That's the orange. So he knows exactly where it's happening. Mm. <laughs> the Eddie Murphy Get laugh. laugh. <laughs> That dude's a jerk. I know, he's rude. Do you see him in the gorilla costume? Haven't you had enough to drink? Are you kidding? It's not even New Year's. Belushi. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. <laughs> a pointless little argument. Look at him. <laughs> what is he hitting himself with? Beef jerky time. Beef jerky time. Rain already. Coleman. Uh, could, could I offer either of you two gentlemen a, a weird jolt of Coleman. Irish whiskey to us? Oh, yes, it is, Coleman. is Coleman. We are moving. We are moving. <laughs> Please to help me with my rucksack. Oh yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Smooth. Man. Quick little switcheroo. Yeah. Uh, I'm baby. dressed as uh. As they are not doing their job. Not one bit. Embarrassed I was when I saw there's someone at the party with the same costume. They're pretending like they're dressed up as baggage handlers. Do you remember me? It's Lionel Joseph. Lionel! They did not. Conference, right? Yes, Simon. I was director of. There's not a different stereotype they could have put on this man like they did everybody else. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> did he see? Memory. Good man. Yes. Okay, because his hands are white, so he that doesn't make him. So the train will be pulling into Philadelphia. Second guess, this guy. Winthorpe. Got him. Hey, back off! I'll rip out your eyes and piss on your. Ah, beaks. And savory. Well, here's where they need to split up and attack him. Mm. Hey, I'm King Kong. I'm the biggest baddie. <laughs> I was there, Tootsie. And no more phony I. Did you see him? Party's over! Hey! Gee! Settles that problem. Solved it. Okay. Duct tape. Really, it's made it easier for yeah. him. Put him in there. <laughs> they're dumb enough, they don't know they there's, so two, dumb, they're there's two gorillas in there now. Boy, that, uh, that other one's getting kind of horny, ain't it? <laughs> With the tranquilizer gun? Ah, oh, it's New Year's. Let them have their... <laughs> No, no. Oh, what a way to start 
your year. Beaks, happy new year. What did they give them? A false reports, I'm guessing? Well, they got the other ones, so... There's no way he gave him the real deal. Coleman, in a couple hours, you're gonna be the richest butler that ever lived, man. They have the real number. Or whatever the real report is, I guess. Coleman, oh, would you please? Thank you. No. Oh. Aww. Let's say she's got the gum in her mouth. <laughs> she put it right back in her mouth. Mm -hmm. See them two go down together. I hope they go and triple their mm. money. Morning, Mr. Duke. No, sir. Not them. No, obviously. of course not them. I hope they lose all their money. Hope they lose every single bit of it. Go get them. And they've repossessed your Bentley. Are you with me? Yeah, well, we gotta kill them, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> he got him amped up. How's hypertension? Golly. Mm -hmm. it must be about to get brutal. High stress environment. Look at that strut they got mm -hmm. going on. Oh, I can already tell you I wouldn't like that. No. <clears throat> Cocoa and sugar, and of course, frozen concentrated orange juice. Frozen orange juice. Now the Duke's trader is going to be buying like crazy right from the opening. We'll be waiting until he drives a pr That's madness. OJ trading opens at nine. Let's go kick some butt. Let's go. This pure madness. Pure madness. And the stock market, you know, this type of investing type of thing is like really above my head. They think they got it too. Mm hmm This is hectic. How do you keep up? That's exactly my thought. They know something. I can feel it. Let's get in on it. So now everybody's doing mm -hmm. it. South Dawn in April of 142! <laughs> oh, so now they're sailing, mm -hmm. selling while the price is up? Unless that crop report, God help us! Uh... They're starting to see it. what's yeah. happening. I told you we shouldn't have committed everything, you asshole! They did, they put everything into it. Everything. Oh my gosh. You see the numbers going down? Uh, and they just sold all that. They're about to be rich. Wilson, for Christ's sake, sell! Oh, do you see how fast it dropped? And they were selling theirs mm -hmm. when it was high. It was high. <laughs> now they're buying them all back. While it's very, very while low. While it's super low. They're going to corner that market. They're going to own all the stocks to that market. Okay, let me... Because math... Numbers. Get back in there at once and can't process that as quickly. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> they just literally made it out. Happy New Year! Oh, one time. Valentine. Hey! Today. Oh. This does after everything we've done for you. Oh, see, I made Lewis a bet here. We'll get rich and put you on the poor house at the same time. You didn't think we could do it. I won. <laughs> awesome. One dollar. One dollar. <laughs> after you. Certainly. <laughs> you know perfectly well we don't have three hundred ninety-four million dollars in. That's how much they lost. Randolph and Mortimer Duke. My God, we're ruined. You're ruined. A uh, Duke has been sitting on this exchange since it was founded. Look at him, he's worked up. It belongs to us. My God. Oh. We better call an ambulance. Fuck him. Oh. I want trading reopened right now. Get those brokers back in here. Turn those machines back. Your brother might be having a heart attack.
Hey, your F him. Hey, give me my money. <laughs> no, it was no hesitance. He just. Where in the hell is Beaks? Beaks. Where is Beaks? <laughs> that gorilla cage. Still. What do I know? Anyway, take a look. They're in love. Oh. Beaks going to Africa. They literally got all their money and put the other guys broke. Yeah. What should we do about lunch? The lobster, the crack crab. What do you think? <laughs> Dimitri, sir. Colin is no longer the butler. Extra primo good, Mr. Coleman, sir. Yeah, Coleman's the richest one there, I think, because Coleman put most of his money in. Said. Looking good, Billy Ray! Feeling good, Lewis! Yeah, because Coleman and her gave them their money to use. They eat, they all bought. Look at them living it up. That is cool. Wow. Dude at the end though, literally said, hey, your brother may not be well. He said, he said to hell with him. Okay, I don't care what's the matter with him. Give me my money. Guys, that was good for a great mm. laugh. Honestly, that was like, good. you know when you have Eddie Murphy and anything that you can have a good laugh, but the whole cast in this one just made this movie really funny. And I love how, you know, it all started off with this experiment and the two men that they decided to mess with their lives. You know, is a black and a white man at the over end together. Over a dollar. Yes, over a dollar, but at the end they worked together. The two of them were smart, they worked together, and you know, everybody wound up getting some money out of it. I mean, it was, to me, it was pure greed and pure evil and twisted. For a dollar, no, just to for, for the two old men to just be like, hey, let's see if we, if we ruin his life, how he'll turn it. Yeah, and it was all about uh, where you grow up, like uh, right. your environment versus genetics. So I don't know. It was it was really a great like laugh for today. We really really needed that. I appreciate you guys suggesting it. No doubt about it. Definitely a good movie. Another Eddie Murphy and him and Dan Aykroyd played so well. And even J Jamie Lee Curtis. I, Jamie was Lee good Curtis. As well. Like for me, honestly, it's crazy because growing up, um, the Jamie Lee Curtis that I knew was a lot farther in her career. She was, she was older. She was older, so getting to see her so young now is it's really, really cool. And it's like a completely different side of acting. That completely I'm, different. <laughs> you really get Completely getting to, different side of acting. When you say you're getting to see Jamie, that you get to yes, see Jamie Lee Curtis. Auntie Jamie. <laughs> Auntie Jamie, we get to see you. But um, guys, that was fun. I can, we have a lot of great uh, movie suggestions that you guys have given us uh, for this month, so we can't wait for you guys to see what we've got coming. Thank y'all so much for the suggestion. As we always send you guys out of here, no matter what channel it is on, we love you, we thank you, we appreciate you, and remember every day that you wake up is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for you new family members to hit that subscribe button, we love y'all, but y'all will go every single day just like we do. Tell them that goal, mom. You're gonna make somebody smile, y'all. We love you guys, and until our next video, we'll see y'all later.